Pentagon has ordered a second carrier strike group to the Eastern Mediterranean Sea and is sending Air Force fighter jets to the region as Israel prepares to expand its Gaza operations. U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin said in a statement on Saturday, October 14, 2023, The U.S. warships are not intended to join the fighting in Gaza or take part in Israel's operations. But the presence of two of the Navy's most powerful vessels is designed to send a message of deterrence to Iran and Iranian proxies in the region, such as Hezbollah in Lebanon. The movements are part of our efforts to deter hostile actions against Israel or any efforts towards widening this war following Hamas' attack on Israel, Austin said in a statement. The first carrier strike group, led by the USS Gerald R. Ford, arrived off the coast of Israel last week. Now, the USS the White Eisenhower Strike Group, which deployed from Norfolk, Virginia on Friday, is headed to the eastern Mediterranean. The aircraft carrier was initially set to sail for the waters of U.S. European Command. It is unclear at this point how long the Ford will stay in the region once the Eisenhower Carrier Strike Group arrives, one U.S. defense official told CNN. The Eisenhower, which is the flagship of the Carrier Strike Group, will be joined by a guided missile crusade and two guided missile destroyers, Austin statement said. The Eisenhower can carry more than 60 aircraft, including F-A-18 fighter jets. The Ford can deploy more than 75 aircraft. From Lagos, this is Space in Wabuko, News Express, Nigerian Salvation.